showing my face on recording, guys. Oh my gosh. But hey, yo, it's Ari, and thanks for being here today. I am here to explain some big changes, two big changes that are coming to my channel, and I'm going to be answering some questions that people have asked. And without further ado, here we go. But Ari, what about your next Outlast video? I'm sorry. <laughs> You promised us a new Outlast video every week, and you let us down. I'm sorry guys, please forgive me! Forgive me! I'm sorry! But no, I really am. Uh, I thought it would be important if I explained the changes coming to my channel, and I thought it would be fun if I did a little interactive video with you guys, but I promise I promise the next Outlast video is coming out sometime next week. I'm gonna try my best to get it out earlier next week, but we will see. I'm really gonna try hard. And that brings me to the first big change. I'm gonna be showing a recording of me also while I play. Excuse my setup, guys, it's very messy, but here's my new webcam that I'm going to be using to record myself. And you guys get to see me freak out and cry. So, you're probably wondering why I'm wearing these really cute ears. This is the second annou announcement that I have for you guys today. I'm gonna start wearing really cute or really weird stuff while I play each episode of Outlast. I'm gonna try my best to do this, but I might run out of items, but I'm really gonna try hard. It could even be a weird looking plushie, it doesn't matter. But uh, I was wondering if I opened a P.O. box, if you guys would like to contribute to that. Um, you can send me like a T-Rex outfit, a maid outfit, anything like that, but it can't be too skimpy, so no string bikinis. But yeah, if you'd like me to start doing that and you'd like to contribute to that, please feel free to put your vote down in the comments below and let me know. Thanks guys. And now it's time for my favorite part of this video. I get to answer your questions. Yeah. All right, so the first person to ask questions is this person named Mikey, who's actually a friend of mine. So the first one, how much Ari's could a jump scare scare if a jump scare could scare Ari? All, all the Ari's in the world, we're all chickens. I'm gonna get some hate for this, but oh well, we're all chickens. How many licks does it take to get to the center of the world? That is such an important question. We must figure this out for science. Quick, everyone in the world, get on your knees and start licking now. Are we there yet? I don't think we are, but I feel like we're almost there. To be honest, I don't know how many licks it would take from everyone to get to the center of the world. That is a very important question, but I cannot answer it. I am sorry. Mr. Leak 95 asks, if you could have any superpower, what would it be and why? So if I could have any superpower in the world, it would be to make anyone smile or laugh, or to make anyone enjoy their life. You know, we need more happiness in this world, and a lot of people are really down, and if I had the power to go around and make anyone smile or laugh, even just for a little while, that would be so awesome. All right, so the second question I'm gonna answer is out of order, but it kind of ties into the first. Sleepyhead294, what would you do if you knew you could not fail for 24 hours? If I could not fail for 24 hours, I would try my best to get to as many people in the world that I could and make them smile or laugh. This life is really hard and I think a lot of people forget what all to be happy for and to just be happy in general and I feel like if I could go around making a difference in someone's life, making them happy and smiley and laughing, you know, I, I would do it if I couldn't fail for 24 hours. I would, I would definitely do that. Infamous Rush, what is your goal for 2018? My goal for 2018 is to just live and learn as much as I can, to gain all the new experiences that I can, and to just be as 
you know, just to enjoy my life as much as I can, to be as happy as I can, and to also get winner winner chicken dinner with Legion 217 and Player Unknown Battlegrounds. So come on boys, you and me, let's go, let's do this thing. We're gonna be the real MVPs, yeah! I am the one, the way your son don't need the Next question, I knew or asked, Marvel or DC? Why do you have to ask me this question? This question has caused so much pain and anguish that I feel like I'm not gonna be able to live anymore. Why? Why would you ask me this question? It's evil. I can't pick. I can't pick. Marvel or DC? I have made my choice based on one hero. My favorite hero. It is Ant-Man. So if I had to pick, I would pick Marvel solely just because they have Ant-Man. And that is the only reason why. I'm so hurt right now. <laughs> Dreadscar5. Strangest thing you've ever been asked by a fan. I was asked if I was a man. Do I look like a man? Do these do these look like a okay, I can't go that far. I can't show that. That's that's not PG. We gotta keep it PG. But to answer that, yeah, I'm not a man. I am not a man. And that is the weirdest question I've ever received by a fan. Aaron G16 asks, what has you motivated to do what you do? Sorry guys, I'm I'm gonna have to answer this question seriously. No jokes. So what got me motivated to do what I've done is a while back I, play, I was playing games with my friend and he bought me a game called Amnesia and you know I'm the kind of person that gets so scared from horror just from horror movies like I have nightmares even when I'm watching them and I'm not like fully aware I, I still get really scared <laughs> And I still can't sleep at night because I'm a baby. Okay, that was a joke. I'm sorry. I won't joke from now on during the answering this question. I agreed to only play this game if he was in Discord with me. And I did. And he said, you know, you should start filming yourself when you play scary games because it's freaking hilarious. You know, you should, you should just start doing videos. And I was like, okay, why not? You know, I'd probably annoy people because I'm annoying. But, oh, I just joked again, dang it. But... Yeah, so on to the serious part. This past semester was my first semester at university and I got just really down. Like I was, I was going through some stuff and I couldn't smile or laugh. Some people made some changes in my life and now I'm happy. And the reason why I make these videos, um, you know, if my friend thinks I'm funny, Maybe other people will think I'm funny. Maybe they can get some kind of laughter from this. Maybe they can smile from it. You know, even if they're laughing at how stupid I look or how weird I am, that's fine. It takes them away from their reality, their stressful lives, and they can laugh at me. They don't have to deal with their real lives just for a little while. They can relax and laugh or smile. And I, You know, I just want to help people smile or laugh even if it's just for a little while you know life is hard and you know everyone deserves to be happy so that's why I do what I do and I enjoy it smash warrior 1993 asks what is my favorite Power Rangers team okay so you're gonna hate me because I, I haven't really watched Power Rangers since I was a teeny tiny tot but if I, I looked, I briefly looked over the different Power Rangers, and if I had to choose based on of just appearances alone, I would choose Samurai Warriors because, you know, Samurai is just awesome, and I am a really like I'm really big into Japanese culture and stuff, and I love Samurai, and like the way they look is just sick, and it just oh, that's so cool. I would I would want to be a Samurai Warrior, so that would be my favorite. Maybe if I watch the show, it'll change. I should start watching the shows again. Favorite cosplay? Mad Scout 92 asks this. My favorite cosplay has got to be the one that I'm currently working on. It's Urza from Fairy Tale, but it's the Urza in her Japanese cloth armor. And 
The reason why this is probably gonna be my favorite too is because Urza is just such an amazing woman. Like she's so strong and caring and kind and I just wanna be like her. Like I wanna protect everyone and everyone I can and be awesome and realistically I'll never be as strong as she is but you know, I'm gonna try, yeah. <laughs> the last cosplay I did was Roxas from Kingdom Hearts and the Keyblade, I kinda just use it for air guitar now. This is my Keyblade! <laughs> just use it better for air guitar now. <laughs> what has my life become? Game to Live asks, why do you live? I see what you did there. I see what you did there! Look at your name! Look what you asked! It's a trap! It's a trick! Oh! I know what you live for! You live to game! It's a trap! But no, um, I live to also game, but I also live just to get the best experiences that I can. I want to learn, I want to explore. I wanna, I just wanna explore life as much as I can. I wanna gain as much knowledge as I can. I wanna spread as much happiness and joy as I can. You know, cause I've, you know, I've, I've been miserable before and I know what it's like to be miserable and I just wanna help people and have fun while I'm at it. Tate hey, Max asks, what are you most currently worried about? Well, what I'm most currently worried about is after I put this video up, I will lose all of my subscribers cause they will see just how much of a dork I am. No, I'm kidding, I don't care about that. But, um, well, I guess I'm not really worried about anything right now. I think during the school year, I'm gonna be kinda stressing about grades and stuff, but I think everybody does. But for the most part, I'm not really, I'm not really worried about much right now, and it's surprising. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it for the video. I really hope it made you smile or laugh, even just for a little bit. I really hope you, you even laughed at me because let's face it, this is gonna be the dorkiest, dorky video on YouTube yet. So I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, and um, oh yeah, if you wanna see me wear weird stuff and if you'd like to contribute to the chaos, uh, just let me know in the comments below. And if I get so many yeses of uh, people wanting to donate weird stuff for me to wear during my gameplays, I will open up a P.O. box and I will share the information in future descriptions of future videos. So just let me know below if you would like to do that and see me in weird stuff. And I just want to say thank you guys so much for everything. Thank you for all your awesome questions. Thank you so much for the love and support. I really appreciate it and I really hope I can make you happy or smile or laugh or just I want to make your day. I hope I made your day. And I hope you go out into the world and you have an awesome day because you deserve it. Yes. But anyways, if you liked what you saw, please feel free to subscribe and join the Ari Cat Army. And I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.